what's up y'all it is Brea Brene here welcome or welcome back to my channel if you are new here please do not forget to hit that subscribe button because you're going to love it here and if you're not new here what's up girl thank you so much for coming back y'all it's vlogtober week three but it's a weekend vlog again because today is friday i ain't vlogged all week yeah it's friday i'm tired y'all i just got done filming a shein try on haul and it took everything out of me so it's going to be going up after this video so go ahead and check it out if you are interested it is fall edition i'm gonna show y'all pretty much all of the pieces real quick i got this cream color cardigan it has a very thick material on it this thing yeah then i got my little wrestler suit <laughs> this is just like a little jumpsuit i got this in chocolate and i also got it in a white color this is like a lounge set it's just a cream little lounge set i got this basic crop tank i get a lot of crop tops y'all i love me a good crop top i hate clothes so like show my little stomach or whatever like i don't know i like crop tops and this was also like majority of the items that i got were basics because it's that time like i needed basics but now that i look back on it like it's just like a lot of basic crop tops so maybe i need to get some basic real shirts i got both of these crop long sleeve an olive color and then this khaki color more basics these are like cropped tanks i got this long sleeve dress it's like bodycon dress i got this long sleeve crop and it's like the twist tie in the front and then lastly this skirt yeah that's a little mini haul for y'all so i have one more thing to show y'all y'all i got my new phone i'm too excited about this phone okay i still have the 13 so it was time for an upgrade i got the 15 pro max in the color black titanium i want y'all to see this like look it's nothing more satisfying than a new phone like uh, it's so freaking pretty y'all look 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 at this that is so satisfying you literally just get the phone and then it comes with the cord but yeah i just want to show y'all my phone we're about to wash this hair let me go get some conditioner I just finished blow drying my hair. It's looking really good. I'm so glad that I was able to finish blow drying my hair because as I was doing it, my blow dryer was literally falling apart. It was also smoking a little bit. The smoke detector was going off. It was just, it was a hot mess. I'm about to show y'all this blow dryer. So this is the cord of my blow dryer literally falling apart. There is a screw right there this part was sliding down like it's it's a mess so i'm just gonna throw it away i am about to attempt to do a braid out i got my perm rods right here i gotta go get my braiding cream and stuff and i also bought a new conditioner a leave-in so i ran to the beauty supply store earlier and i picked up this classic leave-in conditioner so hopefully this works pretty well it is currently 1208 so i need to do what i gotta do and get this hair done currently at a place called Dutch Bros Coffee. Oh, I got a caramel pumpkin brulee chai with a pumpkin soft top, which is like cold foam that Starbucks has. So we're gonna try it. We're gonna see if their chai is better than Starbucks. Mm. Guys, 
got the drink. We're gonna do a little taste test. Y'all, this is good. <laughs> Y'all, it's super sweet, but I like sweet. I'm gonna give it a 10 out of 10. Now I see why the line is long. Y'all, the line is long. They got two lines. They got people outside taking orders like Chick-fil-A and rightfully so. I see why the people be raving. All right, y'all, I'm fresh out of the shower and real quick, we're gonna do some skincare. Earlier on today, I did go to a breast cancer walk and there were vendors there. And there was this lady that sells these different kinds of soaps, some to help with eczema, hyperpigmentation, um, just different stuff. And so I got the soap bar that helps with hyperpigmentation because as you guys may have been seeing, I do have, I had a breakout and it left scarring all along my right side and I'm trying to get rid of it. Okay. My skin was literally flawless in September. It was flawless. And right now, like the scarring is just stressing me out. So we're going to try to get rid of that. I purchased this soap from her that helps with the pigmentation and literally the results that she had was crazy. She had like before and after photos of people that have used her soap and there was this one girl, it was so much hyperpigmentation on her cheek. And in one week, the way that it cleared up, insane, insane. So I'm like, if that could work for her, I hope and pray that it can work for me. So today is just day one. I used it when I got home from the breast cancer walk and now I'm about to use it again. My plan is to use it twice a day and I haven't been using it all over my face, only on this side in this area. Also because I wanna just make sure that it doesn't like break me out. I know if I start breaking out right here, more than likely it's from the soap. So I'm going to start off using my OG cleanser. This is literally my favorite cleanser. Y'all, I started using the Snail Mucin Cleanser. And I ain't gonna lie to y'all, I low-key feel like that might have been like what set my skin off. But the only reason I don't think that it really was that is because I started breaking out before I was, I was using that. And then the breakouts just continued after I was using it. So I was like, mm. so I just stopped using it all together. I really don't know what happened with my skin, but whatever it was, it just made me sad. Also, in the time that I was breaking out, I had ran out of my vitamins. Those vitamins that I take for my skin, I had ran out. So, I feel like that played a part in it too. I don't know. I hadn't had a serious breakout like this in so long. So, my hormones probably just went crazy and it just left me with this scarring that I'm ready to get rid of. I literally did so bad with vlogging this time around, like... I feel like I didn't get no footage at all. I was contemplating about merging this footage with the footage that I'm gonna get for this upcoming week, but I just wanna get a video out for y'all. So hopefully y'all still enjoy it. So with the soap, I I just I'm just gonna wet the little side and I just go like this. I don't want to wet the whole bar because I'm trying to make it last. But yeah. And either tonight or tomorrow, I'm going to take a before picture. So I can do like a before and after. And just keep track with the progress. If I get the results that that lady got in that one week. Oh my goodness. I'm going to be so happy. I feel like that's good. I don't want to overdo it, but... Like, I was in there. Should I do another one? Should I do another cleanse? Can y'all see my pigmentation? Y'all, I have bought these caramel apple cookies from Pillsbury. And I was going to try them with y'all tonight, but it's 1046. I don't know. I mean, it's not late, but it ain't early either. And I don't even really feel like eating no cookies. So I'll probably do it in the next vlog. Lately, to go to bed, I haven't been like doing like this full on routine. I've been trying to let my skin breathe. So sometimes at night, I literally just will tone. Tonight is gonna be one of them nights. Okay, you guys, I'm done doing my little 
skincare really didn't do nothing but cleanse my skin and put a little toner but i like to let my skin breathe at night and now that i'm using this soap i don't want to go in with any like glycolic acid or anything like that i just want to see what the soap can do on its own so skincare is done for the night and honestly this might be the end of this video I'm really so sorry that this video was short, but I still want to get something up for you guys. So with that being said, I really hope that you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, as always, please do not forget to give me a like. Do not forget to subscribe for more content, and I will see you guys in my next video.